Tony here to talk you through today's skill builder representing and interpreting data on a line plot. Maeve is back too to help us along the way. Hey Tony! Remember a line plot, also called a dot plot, is a graph used to show information using a number line. The numbers are below the line, and data points, usually dots are used to represent the information collected. I collected data shown in the chart here. It shows how many times each of our friends visited the skate park this week. I know to start with the title. I think skate park visits works well here. The numbers on this line represent visits, so I will put the label below the numbers. Tony, it looks like you visited the park five times. So let's put a dot above the five. Sal and Ali both had one visit. To represent this, I put two dots above the one. Ali visited five times. I will put another dot above the five. Diesel only visited once. Another dot above the one. Finally, Raj visited six times. The data point will go above the six. You've got it, Tony. Now let's see what we can learn from the line plot. What is the least amount of visits the skaters made? Least means smallest. The smallest number with data over it is the number one. The least number of visits was one. What is the difference between the least number of visits and the most number of visits? Throwing me a tough question. The largest number of visits was six and the least number of visits was one. The word difference tells me to subtract. Six minus one equals five. There is a difference of five visits. Tony, how many visits were made in total by all the skaters? Each dot has a value on the line plot. The three dots above the one are each worth one visit. The three dots together equal three. Each of the dots above the five are worth five visits. There are two dots five plus five equals 10. There is one dot above the six, which is equal to six. To determine the total number of visits, I need to add the value of each of the data points. Three plus 10 plus six equals 19. There were 19 total visits. I am impressed with your knowledge of line plots. Thanks Maeve for showing me how to represent and interpret data on a line plot. I couldn't have done it without you. Let's get another skating before dinner.